Now, the future of the risk of a future pandemic was, as you've already made reference to, prioritised as a tier one risk and remained as such, did it not, throughout your time in office? One of the highest risks um, that the United Kingdom faced. Um, and although um, you tell us at paragraph 12 in your report that, that, um, that it was a pandemic that was prioritised as a tier one risk, in fact, it was more discreet than that. It was an influenza pandemic, wasn't it? Um, that, that's right. I mean, I, I think um, I'm just maybe getting ahead of myself. But when you know, when I look at all of this and read all the papers and thought so much about you know what subsequently happened and the the, the horrors of the COVID um, pandemic, and you know, let me say the massive sympathy I feel for all those who've lost loved ones and for the suffering people have felt and the importance of this inquiry's work to get to the bottom of you know, the decisions that were made, decisions that could have been made, and the preparations for the future. Um, you know, this is the thing I keep coming back to, which is it, the pandemic was a tier one risk. Pandemics were looked at, but there was this, um, the former medical, chief medical officer, Sally Davis, has said it was a group thing. It, much more time was spent on pandemic flu um, and the dangers of pandemic flu rather than on um, pandemic potential pandemics of other um, more respiratory diseases like COVID turned out to be. And, yes. you know, I think this is, this is so important because so many consequences follow from that. Um, and I've been sort of wrestling with, well, why, you know, I think the architecture was good. National Security Council, National Security Advisor, the risk register, and also this new security risk um, assessment, which was a, perhaps a bit more dynamic. Um, but that's what I keep coming back to is so much time was spent on a pandemic influenza, and that was seen as the greatest danger. And it, we've had flus, we have very bad years for flus, so it is a big danger. But why wasn't more time uh, and more questions asked about um, what turned out to be the pandemic that we faced? And I, I, it's it's very hard to answer why that's the case. And I, I'm sure this public inquiry is going to spend a lot of time on that.